I'm Audra Schrader with today's KGMI.com news update. A Linden teenager faces up to two years in juvenile detention for contributing to the drug overdose death of another teen last August. The 17-year-old pleaded guilty to second-degree manslaughter in the death of 16-year-old Aaron Udenhauen. Authorities say the 17-year-old supplied the drugs. Local law enforcement officers say they issued hundreds of tickets over the past couple of weeks during a special emphasis patrol. Officers issued 323 tickets. 204 of those were for failure to use a seatbelt. A boil water advisory is in effect for people who draw their water directly from Lake Whatcom. Officials say a blockage caused thousands of gallons of raw sewage to seep into the lake unnoticed for several days. A Linden School Board member is stepping down. Todd Lingbloom says his job takes him out of the country for lengthy periods of time, impacting his ability to serve on the board. A replacement will be announced in the next few months. Farmers in 11 counties, including Whatcom and Skagen County, are now el eligible to apply for emergency assistance. The aid is available to farmers who suffered losses during extreme weather conditions last October. Be sure to stay tuned to KGMI 790 throughout the day for the latest news, weather, and sports.